okay it's me again i'm just changing the front brake pads on this chrysler so first thing open your uh brake fluid bottle for pressure so when you push your brakes it doesn't get so hard and difficult to release them okay let's get to our wheel now i'm on our wheel so on our brake caliper so i've got my spanner s spanner a the size is 13 so it goes in here the size is 13 but before i go there i have to release first so what i have to release with is screwdriver i'll stick my screwdriver in there you see i'll stick my screwdriver in there so i'm grabbing behind of this outer brake pad and push and push the brake pad in push the brake pad in so on this process the the brake disc is got play so now i'm gonna push against the inner brake pad so now i'm gonna push the i'm gonna push the inner brake pad towards the piston okay okay pull okay stop you pull you push okay it's far enough here's my 13 so yeah you loosen so now i'm gonna do like this i'm gonna do like this so sometimes it's very difficult it's very hard to loosen so you try to hit with your hand and then it comes off if it doesn't want to come off with your hand i've got hammer on the side you just knock it your spanner with hammer a little bit harder if it doesn't want to come off i'm going on the bottom one the same thing it's just that my end is hard so because these brake pads they're not gonna go to the next service one side of the brake pad is a little bit bigger the other one is small so it's wearing different you see this is my brake my brake pad is finished okay yes the inner brake pad is a little bit there but also it's not gonna reach to the next service so I'm gonna put new brake pads. So this is my new brake pads I'm putting now. So yeah, so this brake pads comes with grease. So the grease you put behind the pad, this grease you put behind the pad, your pad on the plate here. So this thing you do it for for noise, vibration of the brakes, the noise. This thing sometimes they, these things they get towards these plates when you break sometimes they squeak because of these plates okay so now i'm gonna put the outer one like pad so now i'm preparing to put the inner one so i'm just putting that crease on the back of the pad so if some of the some of the brake pads sometimes they don't come with the grease, so you have to put your own copper slip. So if they come without grease, may I put copper slip on? So yeah, I'm gonna put my inner brake pad. Okay, my inner brake pad is in. It's in. As you can see, so now I'm gonna push back my brake caliper. I'm gonna just put, you see, I just slide in when I put new ones. I just slide in because I already open on the first time before I loosen. I already slide in. Okay, so now I'm fastening it. I've got my spanner, so it's quick, it's not that difficult. This one safe very easy. Okay, the bottom. Okay. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is now I'm gonna just give it a tape, a little bit tape with the hammer, just to make sure it's nice and tight. Okay the same as the bottom one 
just to give it that that last titan okay that's it it's a chrysler grand failure uh front black change